Um, could you please tell us your name and what you do? Kwame Kufuanov Nto is my name. Um, I'm an independent researcher with the University of Toronto. There is a project called Media Politics and Representation in Africa. And uh, we research into media and politics, the political economy of communication and media. And um, quite a number of researchers are involved in this project. Uh, Professor Tete is, is, is the one, is the lead researcher in, you know, in, in, in the project. And so um, in many ways, this conference coincides with our focus. We look at how media, communication, and technology uh, impacts our lives. We look at this political economy and the politics around questions of legislation and policy. And we are also particularly interested in ways in which technology acts as a, as a, as, as a base to, as it were, giving democracy some more expression. Because I mean, increasingly, people have assumed that the presence of technology will solve all our problems, but it's not necessarily the case. And as we keep finding out in this conference, the, even if there are communicative spaces which have been expanded, there is still, there has to be a conscious effort on the part of policymakers to ensure that there's literacy, to ensure that there are a variety of voices that are being represented in the narrative. And if we don't do that, then of course, our, our democracy is in trouble. And as Professor Tuguba said, we need to go back to, to the basis to get these things done. So we, we do all these things. And you'd be surprised that a former electoral commissioner of a country is also part of our research team. So that gives you, that tells you the scope, you know, of, 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 of our research. Yeah. yeah. You kind of doubled into my second question. I was going to ask what it means for you to be part of this panel. Right. Being with all of these other practitioners and scholars who have Ghana's tech future right. in mind. What, what was the experience like for you? Well, I think, I think it's been useful. I mean, so far it, it tells you the interdisciplinary nature of our research, that whichever way you look, we are connected. And it's just a matter of emphasis, all right? So you find somebody who is talking about how institutions should work, and the, reason, and, the, and, and, the, and the solution he proposes is that we should go back to the Constitution. That's, that's Professor Tuguba's keynote, all right? For us, we can make the argument that media regulation in this country needs to be looked at as an institution, all right? That it has, it has faltered badly. And if we want to be able to get people to be involved in decision making and be part, I mean, let's say that if, if, if we want to understand that access is not just having access to a signal, but it also involves participation, then there has to be a conscious effort to empower the person who is participating in the process, okay? And that doesn't just happen. It comes through critical thinking, it comes through legislation, it comes through careful policy, and all these things come together to make it happen. So, so, it's, so it's so very important, if you ask me.